Hello YouTube, how are you guys? My name is Masabo Mer and in today's brand new episode of my channel, I'm gonna review a website uh, or simply uh, an awesome, a cool graphic designing website called VecTZ.com which has been launched in this January and it's pretty cool. The review of the website uh, was actually suggested by uh, their actual company called VecTZ.com or a website. So thank you Christina for your suggestion and also this video is not sponsored. Uh, so guys this is the actual website as you can see the link would be in the description and the best thing about this website is you can design or create your vectors. If you are learning about vectors for the first time in this video, so I'm gonna tell you that vectors are such images which won't get pixelated whatsoever as you can see in the screen. Uh, it wouldn't matter if you increase the size or decrease the size. Uh, it won't give a shit. So, so right guys, if you are on this website, uh, you can either create your account uh, or just simply start designing. So as you know, this is a tutorial. I'm gonna just click on start designing. So this is the actual uh, workspace for you. Uh, if you guys have used Photoshop or Adobe Illustrator or even CorelDRAW, you might know some stuff about uh, editing tool. If not, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna teach you. And as you can see, the first impression is quite good, but we actually don't need this. So to remove that, I'm gonna just drag uh, it from right here and I'm gonna press delete. As you can see, the, um, the workspace is now clear. Now as you can see, the background is clear. Uh, now I'm gonna click on this background icon to change the background. Uh, to change the background size, you can either just drag it like this, it's beautiful, or even you can write your uh, or resolution I'm gonna write 1024 uh oh seven it, oh my oh, it doesn't matter it's, it's a tutorial and the next thing is fill setting if you want to add some background just like this which is oh my god it's shit but for example just take it <laughs> uh, it's an example okay I'm fine with this so the next thing I'm gonna add is some text and to do that I'm gonna just click on type and as you can see I click or drag to add text and there are three types of text in here uh, large medium small oh my god I didn't know that so uh, for this tutorial <laughs> I'm gonna just click on this large text and as you can see it's pretty awesome there are two ways to actually enlarge your text uh, the first one is by and dragging this portion or the second one is by simply sliding the size uh, oh yeah you know what I mean to place the text to the right side as you can see I just can't do anything I'm gonna go to the select option and I'm gonna simply drag this large text here now to edit this you just have to go to the type again and simply type your favorite uh, text which would be my name yay oh my god uh, I, I actually don't like this font uh, now to change the font you're gonna go to the type exactly and type face and by type face it means your font you're just gonna click the options like right here and select your font uh, actually these fonts are beautiful you can choose any of these uh, so as a tutorial I'm gonna choose this one oh yeah this this is the font I like it's pretty clean pretty nice now as, in, now as you can see the size is pretty small I'm gonna go back to select option and I'm gonna drag it like this yay I love this and yeah it's pretty awesome uh, the next thing I would wanna add is some elements or shapes you can add shapes illustration uh, or collage templates uh, it's uh, up to you so for example I'm gonna add if you are a beautician channel which it is not but for example yeah what what it, it doesn't matter uh, I'm gonna add this beautiful heart here and I'm gonna make it red to do that I'm gonna just go to select option I'm gonna select this heart and I'm gonna change the fill settings 
uh, and um, probably the heart would be red oh my god it's okay for ex okay oh my god now you might notice this uh, that in photoshop we have layer options how are you gonna achieve uh, in this victeasy.com now the layer of my text is beneath this hard to arrange it i'm gonna just click this and as you can see it's pretty awesome and it's it works pretty much the same and the next thing which you would want to know is you can add rulers or outlines uh, i don't know about outlines but rulers are really important in uh, software uh, and editing softwares or website and the last thing i would want to use is your pen tool if you are a vector designer you should know about pen tool i have a bunch of tutorials in my channel uh, you can you, you can get to know about them later but i'm gonna i'm gonna show you some example i'm gonna make a shape like this uh, exactly just like photoshop if you hold the shift you're gonna uh, uh, make the shape in proper proportion just like this this is a shape and if you want to delete the shape just select this i'm gonna press delete now lastly you're gonna go to downloads to save the file yeah if you wanna save the file in svg in vector uh, so basically as i told you earlier uh, even though if you gonna drag this file or or increase the size of this file it wouldn't get pixelated so for example I'm gonna download it in SVG or vector uh, after this you're gonna go to download uh, or download the SVG file now the file has been already downloaded I'm gonna just check it out so this is the file as you can see it's pretty beautiful and if you want to download into your uh, png or jpg uh, just you just have to click the option and i'm going to download it the png format and click download hang tight okay i'm tight okay <laughs> so this is the file and let's check it out boom this is all for today guys so i hope you have enjoyed the video do check out the website and do work upon it uh, you might and become a great graphic designer so thank you guys for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe see you in the next video